Hi everyone, I'm Jessica. Welcome to the Paul Mitchell YouTube channel. Today, super exciting because I will be breaking down our new Paul Mitchell Clean Beauty line. Before we get started, whether you are a returning subscriber or you're just stumbling across our YouTube channel, thank you so much for tuning in. If you're not subscribed, we make hair videos and anything relating to that. So if you're interested, make sure you hit that subscribe button, but we're gonna go ahead and jump right in. April's Earth Month and we thought what better time is there to speak about our clean beauty line. For those of you that don't know, Paul Mitchell roots in sustainability and earth friendly ways way back from when it started. Paul Mitchell has an Awapui farm in Hawaii. It's completely off the grid. It's self-sustaining and it is a huge integral part of Paul Mitchell. There will be a link down below if you want to learn a little bit more about the Awapui farm. There is lots of good information. It's really interesting but I'm not going to get into that in this video because this video is all about clean beauty. For us, clean beauty is defined as high performance products that are mindfully crafted and produced with clean ingredients and eco-friendly manufacturing processes. And it's a big part of our commitment to a more sustainable future. So basically, in a nutshell, clean beauty is made with natural origin, clean ingredients, packaged and bio-based plastic packaging to continue leading in our efforts to a more sustainable hair care. So one of my favorite facts about clean beauty, which I just kind of mentioned, is that it is made with bio-based plastic. It's completely recyclable and it is made with clean energy which I think is pretty cool. So our formulas are made with organic botanicals that we grow on a biodynamic farm. We manufacture our products using good vibes and 100% clean energy, which helps reduce pollution, greenhouse gases, which leads to an ultimate farm to bottle experience. So that's just the tip of the iceberg. There will be links in the description box with resources for Clean Beauty if you want a little bit more information on that, but we're gonna go ahead and get into the actual Clean Beauty products. The great thing about Clean Beauty is that there are four categories, to different hair types so that means there are products for any and everyone so how I'm gonna get into this is I'm gonna break all of them down there's quite a few products and I don't want to miss anything I want to give you all the facts so I actually have notes on my phone that I'm gonna be referring to so please excuse me if you see me taking a peek at my phone so first I'm gonna start off with the everyday routine so the everyday routine is infused with aloe vera to soothe and moisturize strands and organic cold pressed argan oil to nourish hair with antioxidants for added protection and shine. Wanted to start off with this one first because it is great for all hair types. It leaves your hair so shiny and manageable and bouncy. My personal tip is if you're not sure where to start with Clean Beauty, I really recommend the everyday hair routine because again, made for all hair types and you have all your bases covered. So as you saw, there are three products in every day. We have the shampoo, conditioner, and leave-in treatment, starting with the shampoo. So this is great at a everyday wash. It doesn't strip your natural oils. This shampoo gently cleanses your hair and your scalp for a refreshing, sulfate-free lather. Next up, we have the conditioner made with the same ingredients as the shampoo and the leave-in. Just like the shampoo, it leaves your hair more manageable, soft, shiny. The great thing about this conditioner that it not only does what a conditioner is supposed to do, but it actually improves the elasticity of your hair and it's ultra rich and moisturizing. Lastly, we have the Everyday Leave-In Treatment. This one's made with the same ingredients. It is silicone free and it just helps reinforce that nourishment, that hydration, and it helps detangle your hair as well. Side note, I'm gonna share the products that I love and use the most, but I just wanted to break down all the products first and give you all that great information before we get into my personal favorites. Next up, we have the Hydrate Routine. Now, this one only comes with the shampoo and conditioner and this is great for dry hair so these two products are infused with organic olive and oat peptide the olive helps lubricate and condition hair with high qualities of oleic acid squalene and phytosterols the oat peptide is a plant-based extract derived from oat proteins and it's an excellent film former on hair which helps provide strength while also conditioning the strands. The Hydrate Shampoo adds a little bit more moisture to your hair and helps soothe the scalp without stripping any of your natural moisture. So this conditioner is very ultra rich, very hydrating. Intense formula for very parched hair. So if your hair is really dry, I definitely recommend this conditioner. Now I really love this pair right here. I use it a lot more before I got my hair trimmed and got rid of all those dead ends but this helps so much in keeping my hair a little bit more silkier soft to the touch because my hair was going through it so i really love this shampoo and i actually you know what 
<laughs> let me get through all of this and I will share with you how I interchange these and what products I love the most. I will get carried away, so we'll wait on that. Next up, we have the Smooth or the Anti-Frizz Routine. This is great for textured or frizz-prone hair. It is enriched with organic cold-pressed almond oil to soothe and condition hair and hyaluronic acid to provide essential hydration. In case you didn't know, hyaluronic acid actually can hold a thousand times more its weight in water. So that's how you know it's very hydrating. So this routine has three products, shampoo, conditioner, and leave-in treatment, as you saw, starting off with this shampoo. The anti frizz shampoo helps soothe the surface cuticle of the hair and helps calm frizz for silkier, more manageable strands. So here you see that almond oil and that hyaluronic acid really pull through in the shampoo. And just like the shampoo, we have the conditioner, same ingredients. This is a very ultra-rich formula and it helps to soften and smoothen the hair. Then we have the leave-in treatment that helps control fridge and really lock in that moisture and reinforce the shampoo and conditioner in your styling. So if you have the curly natural hair, this is a great place to start right here. You have your shampoo, conditioner, and leave-in to really help the frizz and reinforce that moisture with the hyaluronic acid and almond oil. Hard to hold because I have the bigger liters. So I have the Repair Shampoo, Conditioner, and Leave-In Treatment. The Repair products are formulated with organic amaranth extract and vegan pea protein. The amaranth extract is a small peptide that penetrates the hair for improved manageability without weighing it down. And the pea protein is a superfood rich in amino acids and adds hydration to help reduce hair breakage. And these are good for damaged, brittle hair. So just like the others, there are three different products, the shampoo, the conditioner, and the leave-in treatment. Starting off with the shampoo. So the repair shampoo helps repair and protect your hair while washing away impurities and any buildup that you have on your scalp. And it is also sulfate free. Next up is the conditioner. It does have the same repair qualities as a shampoo. It has a reconstructing formula that helps repair the strands and also helps protect against chemical and physical damage. The leave-in treatment helps reinforce that amaranth extract and pea protein, but it also helps to detangle your hair, soften it, and reinforce strength in your weakened hair. I do also want to note that Obviously, I have the liters of these, but the shampoos and the conditioners, they can all come in the liter size. This size is the 8.5 fluid ounce, and then there's also a smaller travel one. Those are all on the site. Just in case you were confused that these were bigger, I just wanted to know that they all come in these sizes as well. All good stuff. Now, I'm going to get into the products I use the most, which... I have the repair right here. I have the liters for a reason because I use these the most. I also have the liter in the hydrate. I am almost out of this one as you can hear but I have the liter for this one and I like to mix these. I use the hydrate shampoo and the repair conditioner because again I think I mentioned that my hair was not doing good because I was blonde and it was breaking and it was very dry and I also have a dry scalp and this worked wonders for helping cleanse my scalp and it really just helps soothe it and for that I was very thankful and it worked out. It did not weigh down my hair and I did love the conditioning aspects of the repair conditioner so I use these in tandem it is my favorite duo and though these are obviously different routines feel free to mix them up like I do another great mix that I do enjoy is again that hydrate shampoo mixed with the everyday conditioner I love the smell of everyday it almost smells like a cologne to me it smells so good. Anyways, it smells really good and these pair together. When I want gentle moisture, I reach for these two. So from this video, you can probably obviously tell that Hydrate is my favorite. It literally covers all my ends. Literally, it covers my ends and my scalp and I love how it makes my hair feel. The way that my hair is just so much more manageable is a huge plus for me. Now that sums up Paul Mitchell Clean Beauty. Whether you've tried Clean Beauty or not, we'd love to know which routine is calling out at you. Leave those down below and as well as any of our videos or products, if you have any questions on that, make sure you comment those down below and we'd be happy to answer those. But thank you so much for watching. If you're not subscribed, make sure you hit that subscribe button. We'd love to see you in the next video. Again, thank you so much for watching and we hope you have an incredible Earth Month as well as any other month. Bye!